Hello. In this video, we are going to learn the right and left functions in Excel. So let's start. In this uh, section, we have prepared three separate examples for right and left functions, and some of them have some little tricks in them. So let's start with the first one. The first one asks us to use right function because we want to last three letters in this text. Right function lets us to take a small part of the selected text. So let's see how it works. I write my right function and it asks me to choose a text. I choose this text and asks me to uh, choose the number of characters in that. So I'm going to use only the last three letters. So I write three here and I close my function and it thinks the last three characters here and I copy and paste my formula and the first section is done actually right and left function works in a similar way but in the second question there is a little trick it doesn't give a, a certain character limit to us but it wants us to use this column for the number of characters so we are going to use the left function here it will going it's going to use it's going to take the first x characters from these text so let's write our left function and I choose this text notice that the number of characters is optional so if you if, you, if I leave it like this it just takes the first Character. So it's this is valid also for the right function. It just takes the last character of the selected text. But I don't want this. I want to choose my number of characters. The number of characters I'm going to use is written here. So now I close my function and you see it uses the first four letters. If I copy and paste you see our number of characters is parametric now it changes here if I write 2 here it's going to use the first two letters from this text and let's go to the last example in this section it asks us to use the max function to find the biggest stock number and stock numbers are here here you see this is a table with stock number and product okay we are going to find the biggest stock number but first we have to separate these stock numbers from these product names so we see that all stock numbers are three characters so we will take we will use left and choose this text and take three characters and copy and paste on okay you will see the small tip here as I write my max function and select my region it won't find the max function uh, max maximum number because left and right functions returns texts instead of numbers even you see this as a number this 897 is not a number in order to convert this into a number a small trick can be just multiplying this one so now this is these are going to be numbers so you see now the biggest stock number is four seven four uh, nine four seven from game console okay let's submit our answer and it seems okay thanks for watching in the next video we are going to learn how to use random functions in Excel. so keep following